Day 24 of Vlogmas, which is the last day. My name is Jana and you're watching Finnish Knitting Stories. Welcome! Today we're having beautiful sunny day, as you can see. I couldn't find a spot in our living room where the sh sun wouldn't shine in my face. So I hope it's not too... <laughs> it's not bothering too much, but I could not find a better spot. Anyway, it's going down already because it's half past one. Yeah, the days are still very short here and there. <laughs> yeah, but they are they are getting longer already. I'm having a very short, quiet moment. I'm alone in the house. Uh, kids went outside to play with my mom. They are planning to build a snowman if the snow is sticky enough. And my hubby went to pick up flour because I've been cooking so much we ran out and I still need to make my my fruit cakes. Yeah, I did not manage to make them yesterday. It was my plan, but I ran out of time. Uh, I'm having a cup of coffee, mug of the day. <laughs> Moomin mug of the day. We have a house today with all the moments. I love this one as well. There is the Moomin house. It's a very sweet mug. I'm having my my black coffee. <laughs> and then I've been trying to finish my socks, my, my beautiful advent socks. I'm already working on the toe. I have all 24 stripes in. I have 12 stripes on the leg and 12 stripes on the foot because I have a big size. So that just worked out for me nicely. And now I'm working on the on the toes. I think I will Sorry, my oh, my turnips are running over. <laughs> I'll be back. I'll be back. My turnips are boiling. Oh no, I forgot my turnips. <laughs> I'm back. I had this great plan that I will do my casseroles already yesterday and I didn't. I don't know. We were just doing all sorts of other things here with the with the family and I didn't do my casserole so I'm doing everything now I still have time before dinner I have my vegetables cooking I have everything ready for the salads oh, the sun <laughs> for the salads and yeah not that much left then I will shove the turkey roll in the oven and we're we're good to go and I'm waiting for the flour for my fruit cakes I will do those next but now I'm having a little break yeah I was saying that I'm I'm knitting on the toe and they, they should be done tonight and then I will block them and I can wear them tomorrow morning. They are so, so, so lovely. Yeah, okay, not gonna put it there. Just so pretty. Very excited about my advent socks. I'm having a bit of candy here. <laughs> Uh, and I'm also knitting on my mom's cardigan. Now you can see the color, right? It's a rusty, rusty color. This is also drops uh, brushed alpaca silk. Uh, same yarn that I used for my magnolia, for my chunky magnolia. I'm knitting one for my mom, but this one is size small, so it should be pretty fast. I started it yesterday morning. I'm this far, I'm this far along, I think some five more centimeters and I will be separating the sleeves. The only problem is that I have so many projects that all my shorter cables are taken. So I had to take the one that I usually use for shawls. I think this is 120 or 150, 150. I'm having super long cable and it slows me down a little bit because all my other cables are attached to my other projects. Somebody has a lot of a lot of whips left for the next year and I'm using my Addi interchangeables, my favorites. So first two balls going and the, the card is coming. The dishwasher is running I hope. <gasps> now the sun, the sun went behind the trees, now you can see me. <laughs> Look I have my festive earrings in, these are Yolo Torto earrings. They are polymer clay, I, I bought these from a Finnish artist. And I'm wearing my festive sweater. I'm all festive, festive nails, festive sweater. Yeah, and earrings. Still need to do makeup, maybe. I don't know, not not sure. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's just us here, but would be nice to look nice. 
Uh, I still have some gifts left to pack. I'm not going to be able to finish my mom's shawl, but I found another shawl that I have in my stash that I have never worn. So I'll give her that and a pair of socks for for Christmas and I will try to finish the shawl for New Year's. So she will she will get two shawls and a cardigan and a pair of socks. Uh, yeah. What else? I don't know what else. Nothing much. Nothing much. Christmas meal preparations going on. Yeah, I've been cooking, cooking, cooking. It's always like that here on 23rd. <laughs> um, but I'm soon done. Just the fruitcakes in the oven and the... Uh, itchy nose. Sorry. And the turkey in the oven and... And we're good. We're good. A couple of salads. I'm doing potato salad which is the fancy version with the ham because it's for my husband he loves that i'm doing carrot pea salad with fresh carrots and canned peas and then i'm doing beetroot salad for our daughter she loves that she loves that one yeah two casseroles uh, turkey roll uh, what else yeah fruit cakes and uh, my husband stopped by his parents and I think his mother is sending us one of her casseroles. Could be carrot. I don't know yet. And then some fish. They always get a smoked fish for Christmas. Smoked salmon. So we will have that as well. Yeah. Uh, because they have some friends who own a fish shop and they always order from there for Christmas. And we always get the get a gift from them yeah a piece of smoked salmon <sighs> our tree is behind me i'm really enjoying it it's it's a very nice tree yeah the boys did a good job picking a bigger tree this year and i don't know really nothing else i've been just enjoying time with my mom it, it has been great the weather is nice we got a lot of snow last night yeah, it's again white outside. Very nice. And the kids are enjoying it too because now, now there is actually snow. Yeah, where maybe if we get a warmer day, we will maybe yeah go slide down the hill. We usually do that in winter with the kids. But only if it's, it's a bit too cold now to go there, I think. It was, I think, minus 12 or 15 in the morning when I went with the dog. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm gonna go and keep cooking and I will try to record some snippets for you. And I don't know, if if I if I don't manage to fit everything in today's vlogmas, I might be able to make a short vi video for tomorrow. Because, yeah. I don't know about my timeline, but we will see. Yeah, but I will figure it out. Thank you for being here during the vlogmas. Thank you for watching, enjoying, commenting, subscribing. I really appreciate it. It has felt very nice and warm and not scary at all. I was worried in the beginning, how am I going to do? Yeah, is it going to be fine? Will I be able to get through it? But look, we are on day 24 and I didn't even skip a day. <laughs> even on the hardest days, I, I pulled it through because you were inspiring me. You were sending the messages and positive comments and... We're here now. I still need to open my fiber. I think I'm gonna go fetch now, just in case, because the light is good. I'll go get my fiber calendar and the last mini skein. Just give me a second. Yeah, I'm back with the with my fiber calendar and and ooh, these are fun. These look like Christmas tree. Look at that. And I got Earl Grey organic organic Earl Grey tea. Yeah, now you have seen mirrored image because I'm a front camera. But look, these are so pretty, so exciting. Yeah, that's that's the last of my fiber calendar. And this is what I got in my half advent. And this is, this is the gardener. Yeah, nice green. I think I can, I have all the minis here. I think I can definitely build a fade. Let's see. Let's see how it how it all looks. I don't know. I need to play around with this, but there there is my half advent by Artemis Yarns. Yeah, it's a mirrored image, but look at the nice card. <laughs> yeah, 
the sun came out again. Yeah. But I think I can knit something fun. These look like our daughter's colors, most of them at least. So I don't know what am I gonna knit with them, but something something fun. Somebody asked uh, how are you supposed to use the mini minis? Do you need to use them in one project? I think you can do whatever you want with them. Yeah, I think you can put them all in same project. There are so many good ideas. Actually, on Ravelry, I have made a bundle where I have collected all my favorite. In my Ravelry account, you can find them. Bundle where I, yeah, where I collected all my favorite uh, projects that are suitable for patterns that are suitable for advent calendar knitting. It's called something like I, I'll try to link it down below. A link to that bundle. Like the idea is what you can do with it. You can do shawls, you can do sweaters, socks, hats, whatever, blankets, yeah, all sorts of things. Like this is the last year's advent from the Fiber Fox that I had. I made a sweater. This is the Stripes by Andrea Maori. I made a sweater and then from leftovers I made a habitation troll. So or you can knit a lot of stripy socks or maybe some, some nice shawl. Possibilities are endless. Yeah, or some nice blanket. I don't know. You can knit whatever. There, there are no rules about your advent calendars. You can use them however you like. I think I, I usually prefer to make one big project and then use the scraps for several other projects or one another project for, for a scrappy project. So yeah, the leftovers, if I have leftovers from these, they will definitely go into my... Uh, cozy memories blanket mm. something like that yeah i guess enough talking i think my my turnips should be done i'm cooking turnips for the casserole and yeah i need to keep moving because the time is running out it's already yeah, half past one as i said and i still have some some amount of cooking to do not much not crazy much i'm not doing anything over the top this year because it's just us and my mom so it's kind of nice <laughs> not to have a lot of people over for Christmas. Yeah, I, less less tiring for me, less cooking to do. <laughs> yeah, and then for the next couple of days we will be eating leftovers. <laughs> it's it's very nice and relaxing. I hope I get enough knitting time tomorrow, and then I can work work on this. It will be great. I have wanted to knit with this color for so long time, but it's so not my color. Look. It does not look good on me, but it's absolutely, it looks absolutely wonderful on my mom. She's a different type. She has brown hair and brown eyes and we're very different. <laughs> um, so everything that works on her doesn't work on me like this or nice moss green, like mustard, yellow, rustic, all the rusty colors, all the forest, like forest in, in the fall colors yeah I really enjoy knitting with them they just don't look good on me but it's a, it's a nice change okay yeah I'm gonna go now and I will definitely see you later I will keep making my usual uh, episodes my video podcast episodes about knitting and I don't know, maybe occasional vlog here and there because it looks like you enjoyed this a lot. And I think maybe, maybe I can squeeze it in in my schedule. Uh, yeah. Thank you very much. Merry Christmas if you're celebrating. Happy holidays. Happy New Year. And yeah, enjoy this quiet time. Yeah, try to do something, something you enjoy, something that makes your heart happy. Okay, happy holidays. See you later. Bye.